I've seen you here before, and I gotta say, I wish my grandmother was in as good a shape as you are. It's a secret. Please, um, let me bring something out to you here. Okay. Okay, I got these for you. Seriously? It's okay. I, I know you wouldn't want me to pull a muscle at my age. Anyways, right in front of your hips. Chest up tall. Sit down with those weights. Keep your chest tall, okay? All right, gonna exhale and then inhale up. Walk away from a possible acting job. Well, rejection, if I'm gonna be honest. Look at us, feeling sorry for ourselves. Something's weird in the universe today. I wanna do something. I hate this feeling useless. Well, we put it out there, and tomorrow, we may have good luck doing our job in the view. Office job. Wouldn't it be great if we found a job where we make a difference? Something exciting. Challenging, but not too challenging. We could save the whales. <laughs> the cute little dolphin. It has to stop. I love the dolphins. Are you acting right now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, uh. but, but, but I really do love them. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Could you stop? It's embarrassing. Ooh, I wonder how many calories they have. Who cares? We've had a rough morning. What's that? Hmm? What? Joe, us, detectives. Right, can you yeah. just see us? No, don't think so. <laughs> Ooh, it's weird it's addressed to us. Maybe we're being watched. Oh, you're scaring me. Mm. Oh yeah, just show up to some strange place. How do they know our names? Maybe we should consider this. No. Think about it. We both just said we want to do something that matters, right? A detective would be a whole new role for me. No. What do we know about detectiving? Nothing. Hold on, Where, where's your sense of adventure? You're the one that always says the universe is listening. Mm -hmm. you just have job interviews tomorrow, and we're going to ace them. Maybe, but I just think that it's no. something Wait, may, well, maybe we should look into it. No, no. You know, you have to take chances. You, you don't listen to the right universe. You always you have some party Rosie. pooper lately. I'm not a, I'm, don't, I'm not a pooper. You are. Oh, Carolyn. Do you know who you I sound like? should give you it a try. Me. This is not the time to be sound like. I'm Bob. Thanks for coming in. So, tell me a little bit about your qualifications. <clears throat> well, I didn't know I'd be so nervous. I taught aerobics and dance exercise. And you realize this is an office position. I've been a doctor, nurse, teacher. Will you need a receptionist? 
I've auditioned for a receptionist role so many times. A degree in cosmetic analysis. Oh yes, it's a special field. Oh. Um, you take your lip color, you take your foundation, and you take your lip liner, and you look at it. And you let it sink in. And then you analyze it. I was in every single high school play. And then I booked a national serial commercial. It put me on the map. And the School of Cosmetic Industry, where is it? Oh, it's in the East, uh, in the Farm Belt. A cosmetic university in the Farm Belt. <laughs> yeah, go figure. I'm too short. No. Too old? No. Too young? No. Are you familiar with computer software? Um, yes. I know lots of that software. Can you use Excel? Because all oh, of our... Oh, honey, let me tell you. I excel at just about anything I put my mind to. <laughs> Good one. I'm the wrong type, as usual. This is not an acting job? Have you considered retirement? No. I prefer to be out there doing something every day instead of sitting at home on my chubby ass watching TV. Don't mean to be dramatic, but it is in my blood, you know. How do you feel about working with a group of younger associates? They're mostly 20s and 30s. You know, not as mature, shall we say. No worries. I understand. Just one more rejection. I wanted to ask you, what am I going to be writing? A uh, blog? Because I love blogs. Uh, no, not blogs. More like financial spreadsheets. I didn't hear anything. Oh, I must take this call. Yes, but uh, thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for coming in. Are you sure you won't have a cup, dear? It's Ti Guan Yen, named after the Iron Goddess of Mercy, a Buddhist deity associated with compassion. I thought you said I was going to be the right-hand person. Of course you are, my dear. You will be the liaison between myself and the ladies. Why these two? I mean, they know nothing about the criminal system, nothing about undercover work, nothing. And they're no. perfect, exactly the way they are. Who better to go undercover than women who are nobody, who are cast aside by society, who are invisible? Oh, you prefer working alone, since you are a clerk in the Justice Department. This is a good opportunity for you to broaden your horizons. After three husbands and six children, I have very little patience to broaden my horizons. Okay, I am to be your liaison. Yes, dear. And try to be nice. Welcome to the Triple Threat Detective Agency. We want you to work for us.